I mean, you can eat very well in, in a lot of places around the world. But I think what's interesting about San Francisco is that there's this incredible uh, diverse range of restaurants, different styles, fine dining, casual food, um, ethnic foods. But they all seem to uh, fit in San Francisco and they seem like San Francisco restaurants. San Francisco is the perfect place. I mean, it's the people that work in the land here that are very important. They work in the land, you know, they are a part of the economy. Uh, the winemaker is also a part of the economy. The cooking scene was a lot stronger than any other place we drove from LA to Seattle. So there is this integrity and this foundation that's already established in the Bay Area specifically for culinary innovation, agricultural innovation. Planting, you know, growing and using that ingredient in the kitchen and bringing to the table and, and have a story in the plate, it's so powerful. And really, what, what are the authentic flavors of our area and of our time? having been born in Korea and growing up in the States and living in California for the last almost 20 years now. Um, now, how does that experience inform my cooking? It's like a blank canvas. <laughs> I paint my food with the colors I use, with the texture I use. There's so many restaurants, There's so many, it's, like, it's a melting pot of so many cultures. I know you hear that all the time, but there is. Receiving the James Beard Award, was, it's, it's like a dream come true for me. Because, um, you know, as, as a it's just starting out in this industry that's like the highest that you want to like achieve. I see so many different races and cultures and different backgrounds and I feel like I'm home. And everybody's rushing around but everybody's uh, trying to get that little piece of the food and I relate with that. What drives all the innovation in this area really goes back to the gold rush times. Like it's always been this hub where people come from all over the world to try and make it, make it big, so to speak. We have great weather, we have great soil, um, we, we produce incredible wines in Napa and Sonoma. And now I think the rest of the country is looking to San Francisco to see what we're doing and how we're creating these farm-to-table restaurants. It's pretty great to get a Michelin star, too. Yeah, that's <laughs> not bad. <laughs> and I think the common thread is that we work with really great products. We operate with a commitment to sourcing locally and, and having relationships with our farmers, our ranchers, our fishermen, our, our foragers. It's really the backbone of, of, the, of the culinary scene here in San Francisco.